First thing we're going to do is make a sauce for our sandwich. Start with four spoons of mayo. Two spoons of roasted garlic Dijon mustard. Two teaspoons of cracked rainbow peppercorn. One tablespoon of smoked paprika. A tablespoon and a half of apple cider vinegar. A couple shots of Tabasco Chipotle sauce. And finish it off with some fresh dill and thyme. Take a fork and just mix it all together for a couple minutes. Once you have it all mixed up, wrap it up and place it in the fridge overnight. We're going to be using a pork belly, which is usually the cut that bacon's made out of. We're going to go in, trim off some of this excess fat, and take a good part of this cap off here too. With most of the fat trimmed off, we're going to go in, cut in half inch to three quarter sections all the way across. Once you have it all sliced up, brush on a good coating of oil. It's time to add your rub. Add any type of rub that you love to taste. We're using Mary's Cherry Rub. Now this stuff is delicious. With a good coating of oil and rub, wrap it up and place it in the fridge overnight. To cook the sandwich, we're going to be using our Weber 22 and a half inch kettle. Let's take a peek how we got it all set up. Charcoal set up for indirect cooking. Got a water pan there for a little bit of moisture. Grilling stone from BrazilianIce.com and we're going to add one cherry mojo brick for a little bit of smoke. Let that start smoking, we'll go get the meat on. Cherry mojo brick starting to smoke away. Let's get this pork belly on. We're going to let it smoke for around half an hour. Just shut the lid and we'll go start prepping the other ingredients. While the barbecue's out there smoking away, we're going to slice up some provolone cheese, two tomatoes, and one red onion. Once your onions are all sliced up, brush on a little bit of oil on both sides, and we'll go throw them on those grilling stones. Pork belly's been smoking for half an hour now. We got another chimney of charcoal all fired up to get the heat cranked up, so let's take a peek before we toss it on. Looking good. <coughs> Smells even better. We're going to take this water pan right off and add another chimney of hot charcoal. With the grill nice and hot, you can see it's starting to cook those pork bellies a little bit more. We're going to grill up the tomatoes and onions on the grilling stone from Brazilian Ice. So just sprinkle on a little bit of salt and pepper. Throw the tomatoes on for about a minute on each side. It's going to bring out some delicious flavors. Just give the tomatoes a quick flip, let them cook for another minute or two, we'll take them off and get them in the fridge. Next do the same thing for the onions, a little bit of salt and pepper right on the grilling stone. Throw them on and sizzle them up for a couple minutes on each side. After a minute or two, give the onions a quick flip, look at that. Now just take your pork belly. Place it right on the grilling stone for a minute or two on each side. Just give it a flip. You should see a nice sear or crust on it. Let's take it off and go make a sandwich. Now let's get the sandwich together. We're using a French loaf of bread because this sandwich is going to be for six people. Start with a layer of the sauce that we made yesterday. This stuff smells great. So just give it a good coating on the top and bottom. A layer of mixed greens on the bottom. Add a good layer of the provolone cheese. Layer the tomatoes that we grilled up. Just throw them on. Now time for the pork belly. Just go ahead, try and make it as even as possible, and layer it across. And finish it off with the onions we grilled up. Mmm. Cherry pork belly sandwich, all done. Let's put the top on, cut it right down the middle, take a peek. Woo! Looking good.
Now to slice in some more manageable pieces. Check it out. Mm. Good stuff. Mm. A big thanks goes out to Greg at Ballistic Barbecue for putting this sandwich contest on and all the people giving away those great prizes. Can't wait to see all the great recipes everyone comes up with, but cherry pork belly sandwich is tasting pretty damn good. It's easy to do. Barbecue food for you. Give it a try.